My name is John Caker. My company is The Cigar Box. We actually manage corporate cigar programs around the U.S. and the Caribbean. Uh, I was asked to come to Mallard's uh, Bar about four months ago to take over their cigar program with Alan Pierrot. So we came in and we set up um, a new humidor. Uh, we have about 15 to 20 selections now in the new humidor and just a few of the different brands that we offer. We have, uh, for example, um, Tony Barani. We have his uh, new Bahia Gold Maduro. And Tony Barani is a fantastic boutique cigar maker. He re-blended his Maduro to actually be a little more full-bodied than his natural wrap. It was for about 10 years his natural wrap was uh, more full-bodied than his Maduro, so it kind of threw people off. But uh, with this new blend right here, he sold out of uh, his first three months of production in the first two weeks, so really tasty blend. Going on from there, of course, we have um, Casa Magna, 2008 Cigar Aficionado Cigar of the Year, number one cigar of the year. Uh, we also offer some Perdamos. Perdamo, 10th anniversary, um, his blends. Nick Perdamo, Rob Report Cigar of the Year, European Cigar Journal Cigar of the Year. Moving on over to um, Ernesto Padilla. Uh, Padilla actually used to work for Nick Perdamo, and then he decided he wanted to make his own cigar, so he went over to uh, 8th Street down in Little Havana in Miami, and he uh, came up with uh, his Miami selection. So, a few of the others, of course, you have Brick House, put out by J.C. Newman, same company that distributes the Arturo Fuente cigars. And Brickhouse uh, got a 92 rating. Reasonably priced cigar and pretty tasty. Then, of course, in the flavored selection, you're looking at um, some of the Drew Estates products. We have the Acid Cigars and also um, the Java Cigars. Interesting thing about the Java is that Drew Estate was making the Kahlua Cigars for a while. And when Kahlua decided it wanted to get out of the cigar business, Rocky Patel said, hey, why don't I go ahead and uh, try that blend out? And he now has his Rocky Patel Java which are enhanced with the flavors that are in Kahlua. So not necessarily Kahlua, but the flavors that are in Kahlua. Now, our company, The Cigar Box, uh, came up with the idea of having personal humidors. What we tried to do, since we do have this old, old club feel here in Mallards with the dark wood, instead of offering locker systems for private members, what we tried to do is bring that private club experience to individual hotel guests. So when a party comes in of really four people plus, the uh, servers walk over and they place a personal humidor on the table and uh, so the guests can really help themselves to any of the cigars uh, offered in Peabody's selection throughout the night and then they're just billed for whatever they decide they enjoy. So really it's bringing a little bit of that personal club feel to a uh, public space. Mallard Bar at the Peabody is um, I would say the premier spot to smoke cigars in Little Rock. I mean, between the cigar selection, you have the dark, uh, the dark wood feel in here. I mean, you've got gorgeous leather furniture, and really the cigar selection, 15 to 20 brands right now, you cannot go wrong. And um, obviously they put a lot of time into their single malts and bourbons um, selections as well to go along with those cigars.